When you are entering data into a worksheet, you may want to see how the printed output looks like for the worksheet. In Excel, you can change the page view and without printing, you can see how many pages will be printed and how printed output looks like. Excel allows three different views, normal view, page break preview and page layout. You can also create custom views. The example worksheet has some data. The current view is normal view. To change to other views, click on view tab. Click on page break preview. In this view, Excel reduces the zoom so that you can see more area of worksheet. Displays page numbers overlaid on the pages. You can see page 1 and page 2. Displays current print range with white background and non-printing area with gray background. The page breaks are draggable dashed lines. You can change the page break. Current page break is at 46 rows. You can move it up to 44 so that it will be the last row printed on first page. Now click on page layout. This view is print preview and displays what actually prints on each page. It shows header, footer, You can add a header and a footer so that it will be printed on each page. Click on header and you can enter the header and click on footer to enter the footer. You can also create custom views. The custom views are mostly to show the data in Zoom temporarily during a presentation. First create a normal view as a custom view so that you can revert back to it. Click on custom views. Click on add. Give the name as normal view. Click OK to save the custom view. Now increase the zoom to 200%. And now click on custom views. Click on add and give the name as 200% zoom view. Click OK to save the custom view. Now click on custom views again. You can see two custom views are displayed. Click on normal, click show. You can see normal view is displayed. Click on 200% view and click on show. You can see the zoomed view is displayed. Also the custom views displays the worksheet which was active 
when view was created. For example, if you are in sheet 3, worksheet 3, and click on custom views, select the custom view, normal view, and click on show. Excel automatically shift to sheet 1 and displays the custom view. 